So I just got done with another project. Uh, this is almost another man cave update. Uh, there you go. I just built myself a new rifle hanger. So I have room now to display my Ruger over under. Red label 20 gauge. My 10 and a half inch AR. My Arsenal SGL 3162 AK74 and my 1022. All I did was take a couple pieces of wood, some 90 degree aluminum, put two pieces together vertically, and then uh, as you can see, the screws to the H on the top and the bottom. And Oh yeah, there's six of those total. One, two, and three, and then three on the other side. And then I painted it, screwed it to the wall, put my hooks in it, got an extra pair of hooks so I could put uh, four on the wall instead of just three. And it is so much more sturdy, this thing. It does not move. I mean, that 308 right there, and that 30 out six, I would have never put on those hooks just in drywall because I couldn't find a stud to put them in and still have room for the muzzle on this end and the stock on this end. It would hit something. So I just made myself some a new rifle hanger out of a bunch of scraps around my house. It took me about, I don't know, 15, 20 minutes. And I could not be more pleased because... Everything is hung, everything's out of the way. I get to look at my beautiful shotgun, uh, that, which I think I have a video on it, but either way, this is a wedding present that I got from my Uncle Barry. He used to take me shooting, skeet shooting every year for my birthday since I was about 14 until I was about 21. And this is the gun that I would use. So he gave it to me as a wedding present. And it is absolutely stunning. First probably four years that I had it. Three years, I guess. I never touched it. I mean, I, I was afraid to touch it. I didn't want to damage it. Now I shoot the crap out of it almost every weekend. I mean, over the past probably two years, I've put probably 2,000 rounds through it. And I love that shotgun. No recoil, super, super short. I don't even know what length the barrels are. I'll try to remember to annotate it. I'll measure them. But uh, I love it. And now I have a place to keep it instead of just keeping it in its case over in the corner over there like it's like I'm ashamed of it. it keeps everything up away from the wall. Worked. It turned out fantastic, I think. And not to mention, of course I painted it, paint everything. This one I did in a flat, uh, what is it, Krylon, Krylon Fusion Camo Ultra Flat Black base. And then it's all Krylon, Krylon Ultra Flat Camo. All of them are. Green, black, and tan. And then I just kind of peppered them with the green and the tan and I think it came out quite outstanding. So let me know what you think. See ya.